all right boys in case you want to know like what you know how to replace a board in your trailer if one goes bad see those ones are are fine for now like i'll wait till one starts rotting or starts falling through and then i replace um but a lot of these are pretty good but anyway your trailer if it's like mine and i've had a few different trailers obviously over the years and um you see it's got these bolts it'll have probably two places where it has bolts and then it'll be under the the lip of the iron in the back like that and then the front on mine it has another strip right up there and it's bolted down through in three places um these these two just broke off rust and you know when i was trying to undo them with the star head these i was able to get them out there's three that hold this down so i think i'm gonna be able to reuse that and even reuse the bolts so what i did is those broke off took my uh sawzall metal blade cut off the bolt and um drilled a new hole i could have just drilled out the bolt and put it in the exact same hole but i put it you know a little bit off the side because that spot's pretty rusty and it would be kind of hard fighting with it and there's really no reason for it to be perfectly in the middle and so what i did is i went off for that side on that one and then back here i went to this side of the hole on that one so it's kind of evenly supported but like i said that's really not not that critical in my opinion but um and then what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna put a, a bolt through a regular hex bolt because these bolts are kind of they're kind of crap in my opinion but um i'm gonna put like a regular hex bolt like this and um put a locking washer or a locking nut in the bottom and i'm gonna put a washer on the top and on the bottom you know so it can't so through them and what you do is you don't tighten them all the way down because as the boards get wet and dry and wet and dry they kind of expand and contract and so i leave a little space for it to do that so i don't crank them right down and if you do that i mean it'll last for a very long time but um here's the little thing that goes up front you see and um these bolts i think are going to be fine to put right back in there i need to uh, i'm gonna you know, I'm going to take some WD-40 and oil them up good and stuff and put them right back down in there. And so, not hard, you guys. You can replace board on your, by yourself. No big deal. You know, this one's 13, 14-foot trailer. It's a little less than 14-foot. I got the exact, I think it was uh, 167 and a quarter. Actually, while I was at Home Depot, you know, they cut stuff for you free. There's guys right there already cutting another customer's board. So, I told them, I said, you know, can you go ahead and cut this for me? So, that way, when I got home, I mean, it's already should should be already perfectly the length that i need it so let's lay it in there and i'll uh oh and then so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna lay my board in there and then since i already have these holes i'm gonna drill up through the hole up through the board and then i'll know exactly where to put the bolts you know easy nothing to it so after i lay it in there i'll show you guys all right boys as you can see this is my rig so that if you're just one person Put your vice grip right there, kind of pipe so it can hold the top so you can tighten the bottom. I actually decided not to put a washer on the top, just go with the bolt because the, the hole is tight anyway and that way, that way the bolt gets a little bit closer to the board like for mower tires. It'll be fine but yeah, so that's what I'm going to do up there too. Okay, it's the same rig but sweet. It looks good as you can see. It's good to go. I just got to put that strip. Oh yeah, another thing I did. I put it in the back, under the iron in the back, and then I put that to hold it while you drill up from the bottom so it doesn't push the board up, which it probably wouldn't anyway, because this board's pretty heavy, but anyway, I'm about done. Sweet.